What's up, everybody? Welcome to Mad About Toys. McFarlane is absolutely dropping some bombs today, starting with this Batwing from the Flash movie, Gold Label, available exclusively on McFarlane.com. $249.99 US. So I'll be out on this one, but this looks absolutely insane. Very cool. 32 inch wingspan. There's Batman in the cockpit there. Gold label, flash movie. Will you guys be picking this up? Let me know in the comments section below. It just looks great. It doesn't look $249 great. That's for sure. No chance. If you're not, if you're patient, you can definitely end up getting this on sale. No doubt about it in my mind. Some cool figures were dropped. The Batmobile in hand. Pictures of the Batmobile by McFarlane. Looking great. We got Barry Allen here. Who gives a shit about that fucking guy? And we got Michael Keaton. Michael Keaton. I was so excited for this Michael Keaton Batman. And ah, it doesn't really look like Michael Keaton. I'm not sure how I feel about this figure. The photographer at McFarlane Toys is awesome. He takes great shots. And even he couldn't get this to look more like Michael Keaton with the right lighting. I think I'll be passing on this figure, but like I said, I'll wait until it comes out, till I see it in stores in hand to make that decision. Now let's talk about the man himself, the man, the myth, the legend, Michael Keaton. In my opinion, the best Batman to ever do it. Let me know what you guys think. Who's your favorite Batman? But this is be this is going to be coming with a cloth cape for obvious reasons. So you can sit him in the Batmobile and the Batwing, respectively. I think they should have included a plastic cape as well. The sculpt underneath the cowl just doesn't remind me of Michael Keaton. I thought the Christian Bale version looked great. Looked really much like the actor. And what I'm seeing here is kind of disappointing. Michael Keaton, like I mentioned, is my favorite Batman of all time, and it's not even close. I was so excited when this figure was announced, was rumored, and now that we see it, I'm not all that impressed with it. I was much more impressed with the Dark Knight Batman, the Christian Bale Batman. Don't have it in hand yet, so if you do, let me know what you think of it uh, in the comment section below. The ears on this cowl, they look way too big. Don't get me wrong, I like the sculpt. It just doesn't remind me of Michael Keaton. Love the sculpt, really looks good. Looking forward to adding this one into my collection. I'll definitely be picking this one up and the Batmobile up from eCollectibles in Canada. Uh, $95 for the Batmobile, which is around what I thought it was going to be. I think it's $80 in the US. So it's not cheap, but it's it's a huge car, 22 inches long, I think a 1.7 scale. Hopefully, at, standing outside the Batmobile, the figure will look good, look in scale. It looks pretty good from what we're seeing of these pictures of him in the car and in the Batwing. Looks to be a pretty decent scale. But what do you guys think? You guys let me know in the comment section below. I'd love to hear from you. Are you as excited about these reveals as I am? That'll do it. Thanks for watching, everybody. Have yourselves a great day, and I'll talk to you guys later. All done the video.